guys ready for an ultra exciting video today. I know I sure am. I'm wearing my little like lipstick kiss hoodie. It's my favorite hoodie ever. And I'm also wearing my little tiara I got from Disney World. And when this thing goes on my head, you know it's a special occasion. I even did my nails. Yeah, all for today's video. So sit back, relax, get a snack, get a drink, and get ready. Because this video is going to be the bomb. Dot com. Cue the intro. Not that intro. The holiday intro. Hey everyone, it's Kayla and welcome to my channel. In today's video, I'm going to be doing my $100 lip balm shopping haul. Yay! You guys have requested this video so much, like it's kind of insane. So guys, when I did this shopping challenge, I ended up going to, whoa, sorry. I went to Target and um, the bag is so full that this little lip smacker advent calendar fell out. That's why I was like, whoa. Um, so I went to Target. Then I also went to Walgreens and I went to Claire's. So. In today's video, I'm gonna be showing you guys everything that I bought when I attempted this challenge. And you know what? I have to be honest with you. The budget was $100, as you guys know. And um, I may or may not have gone over $100. It's Target's fault, guys. It's seriously Target's fault. They literally had everything that I wanted, okay? So, um, technically I failed at this challenge because I went over budget. So, yeah, but that's okay because that just means that it's a bigger haul, right? But anyways, without further ado, I'm just going to get right on into this video and begin showing you guys all of the lip balms that I picked up. And I hope that you'll enjoy watching. So, let's begin. We are going to start off with... Claire's okay so I got all pucker pops because you guys know I love pucker pops so I just dumped out the bag and the first one that I want to share with you guys is this one right here oh my gosh this is the cutest pucker pop ever and it's so extra it's a rainbow fish and its eyes pop out at you like this wait 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 can you see that Okay, I don't know what I'm doing, but I'm gonna open it right now. It is watermelon flavored. Here we go. Now I can officially squish it. Ready? Wow, look how cool that is. Whenever I first started collecting Pucker Pops back in like 2012, they were literally like two dimensional and super basic. Like at most they'd have some glitter. Now look at this. Like seriously, they've stepped it up a notch or two. Just saying they've really upped their game with these things. So the flavor is watermelon. I want you guys to comment below and guess what color is the lip gloss gonna be? Is it gonna be green or pink or like blue? Who knows? Um, I don't know, comment your guess below. I want you to pause this video and comment your guess. All right, hopefully you commented. Um, so I'm gonna guess that it's gonna be, uh, I wanna say pink. I'm feeling green, but I'm gonna say pink. I'm gonna say pink. All right, oh, I'm so scared. I really hope I'm right. Okay, so pink, 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 pink. Oh, I was right. It's like a really light pink. And let's see if it actually smells like watermelon. Yeah, it smells like watermelon. I'm a happy camper. Cool, cool, cool. So this is the first lip balm of my giant haul. Next up, we have this pucker pop right here. He is so cute. He is vanilla flavored and he's a little panda bear. How adorable is he? I loved him because he looked like a little ice cream. Like, ah, oh, so adorable. Next up, we have this strawberry flavored whale and it has like birthday cake frosting and a candle on his head. Next, oh my gosh, look how cute this is. It's a little panda bear and its ears are like little black sparkly pom poms. I just, oh my gosh, look at its little face, it's so cute. So the flavor is strawberry cream and I simply could not pass this by. It's just, oh my gosh, it's so adorable. And by the way, if you guys didn't know, all of these pucker pops when I went to the mall were literally 50% off and it was buy three get three free so I got all these for like six dollars and it was amazing so anyways the last two that I picked up were mystery ones and these really caught my attention because they're supposed to be like baby themed like right here on the back it shows you what you could possibly get and honestly I would be happy with any of these there's like this little one that's like crying and he has like a giant diaper um this one that's like sucking on a binky this one he's just kind of chilling he's pretty happy and then we have this one with a bottle 
I don't really care which ones I get. I think they're all really, really cute. But um, I think it would be cool to get the one that's crying because it's just like so detailed and really funny. So, oh, that one's Lucy. Oh my gosh, his name is Lucy. My favorite name is Lucy. Like when I have a child, I'm gonna name her Lucy if it's a girl, obviously. So we have Lucy, Susie, Fred, and Bella. I want you guys to comment below. Who do you think I'm gonna get? I think I'm gonna get Lucy. I have a good feeling about this. I hope I get my desired Pocker Pop child. Here we go. All right, all right, let's see. Aw, I got, I got Fred. How cute is Fred? Fred is like so chill and like so happy. I'm not disappointed, that's really cute. And what's the flavor? The flavor is pineapple. So let's see if Fred actually smells like a pineapple. Hmm, I think Fred smells pretty good. I'm not disappointed. Okay, now we're gonna open up this one right here. The only one I hope I don't get is Fred because I don't want a duplicate, all right? Let's see. Oh my gosh, I think I got Lucy, did I? Oh no, that's okay. Um, I got Susie in Blueberry. I'm literally about to go back just so I can get the Lucy one now. But okay, I got I got two cute ones. I like them. They're like BFFs now. That is what I picked up from Claire's. Now we are going to be moving on to Walgreens. And I didn't really get too much here. Um, so we're going to save Target for last because that's like the big shebang. That's where I found everything. Anyway, so from Walgreens, I got these two adorable little lippy pals by Lip Smacker. The flavors are chilled eggnog and frosted cream. Cranberry. So I don't know which is which, but they're both really, really cute, and I'm excited about that purchase. And then I just got these two lip smacker tubes from there as well. This one has a little Frosty the Snowman keychain, and let's see what flavors it comes with, okay? It comes with hot cocoa, peppermint mocha, and holiday punch. So these flavors sound absolutely amazing. And then I also got this lip smacker tube with a little gingerbread man. And um, let's see what flavors are in here. There is gingerbread, candy cane, and butterscotch. So the flavors are very basic, but they sound very delicious. So that is what I got from Walgreens. And now, for the moment you've all been waiting for, I need a drum roll please because I'm about to show you everything that I picked up from Target and girl, it's gonna be amazing. So drum roll please. All right, so here we go. Um, this is my Target bag and this was also included. Um, it just fell out because there's literally so much stuff inside like Oh my gosh, it's insane. So I'm gonna start off with this because it's literally like in my hands right now, so why not? This is the 12 Days of Kissmas Advent Calendar by Lip Smacker. And look how beautiful it is! Oh my gosh, I'm just so excited. So look, you open the little doors to the gingerbread house. And then boom! Oh my gosh, I can't wait to start this. I'm not gonna start it yet though because I gotta wait, you know, until it's closer to Christmas. But um, I'm like way too excited to see what lip balms are in the little pockets. Um, again though, I'm not gonna do this on camera right now because the whole point of a Christmas advent calendar is to open up a little window every day. So that's what I'm gonna do. But I got this and I am so excited about it. Next up, I got these Hello Kitty soft lips and they are Christmas themed of course. So we have chocolate mint. We have sugar plum and we also have gingerbread and I am going to go ahead and open these up right now because I'm curious about them. So first we have chocolate mint. Um, this smells good, but honestly it doesn't really smell like chocolate mint to me. It's very, very mild, but I mean it smells good. It's just not like very strong. Um, so then we have sugar plum. Ooh, that one kind of smells like watermelon to me. It reminds me of the watermelon EOS lip balm. I don't know why, but it's like a very sweet kind of fruity scent. It smells really, really nice. And then the very last one is gingerbread. So let's smell it. Ooh. Okay, again, this one smells pretty mild to me as well. Not that that's a bad thing. I thought this would be a little spicier. 
just because it's gingerbread. These are pretty good. They're really not my favorite ones that I've ever smelled from soft lips. Next up, we have this brand new holiday EOS in the flavor Dazzling Ruby. So I'm really excited about this and I think I'm going to do a separate video opening the holiday EOS. So stay tuned for that. Next up, I got this really cute little EOS tin and look how beautiful it looks. It's just, oh, it's so pretty guys. So the flavors, where are the flavors? Let me see. The flavors are First Snow, Fireside Chai, and Pomegranate Raspberry. And again, they look so gorgeous. So I'm really excited to try them out. Next up, I got a whole bunch of these little $1 lip balms. I found these in the dollar section at Target and I got five flavors. Okay, so we have Strawberry, we have Red Berry, we have Mint Chocolate, we have bubble gum and we also have red velvet and I'm going to test these out for you guys right now and as you can see they were only a dollar so if you guys like what I have to say about these then I definitely think that you should get them because they're super cheap so we're gonna try strawberry first and I'll tell you what I think so there's a little elf on there oh my gosh ah! I'm sorry if I just bursted your eardrums but this smells like a strawberry lollipop. It smells so good. Like it smells identical to a strawberry dum dum lollipop and it was only a dollar. Wow. I'm shook. Definitely get the strawberry one at least. Okay. Now I'm excited to see what the rest of them are like. So now we're going to be trying the Rudolph red berry. Red berry. I wonder what that's going to smell like. Maybe raspberries and pomegranates and strawberries. Who knows? Okay. So here we go. Has a little Rudolph. Ooh. Okay, so that smells like cherries to me. It smells like straight up cherries, and I really, really like it. I think they should have just called it red cherry, but like red berry works too. Anyways, next we are going to be trying mint chocolate. So here it is. Here we go. Wow, that smells so good. It kind of smells like vanilla mint to me though. I don't smell like too, too much chocolate, but it's like really, really nice. It's like a minty vanilla kind of scent and I really, really like it. Um, I'll have to admit, I like that one better than the chocolate mint soft lips and this was more expensive, so just saying. Anyways, now I'm gonna be trying this one right here. This is in the flavor bubblegum and it has a little snow monster on there. The snow monster from Rudolph. Um, so let's see, here we go. Oh my gosh, that literally smells like pure bubblegum. You know, I'm not gonna lie though, it kinda smells like this bubblegum medicine I used to take as a kid, but like I liked it, so I'm not complaining. Um, but we have that one and it smells really good. And lastly, we have Red Velvet. Hopefully this one will be like the bomb.com. Okay, so here we go. Wow. Okay, that's amazing. That actually smells exactly like red velvet. Like, I kid you not. It smells a lot like cream cheese frosting and red velvet. It's so good. And I honestly highly recommend all of these lip balms. And I definitely think that you guys should check them out at your local Target. I found them in the dollar section. So anyways, moving right along. What else do we have here? Okay, we have some Hershey's Kisses lip balms. And... I love these. I think they're so festive and cute and fun. So we have Candy Cane, and I love the packaging. We have Mint Truffle, Cherry Cordial, and then, oh my gosh, I forgot I even bought these. I have even more Hello Kitty soft lipsticks. We have one in Hot Cocoa, we have one in Cinnamon Roll, and we have one in Sugar Plum. So now I have two of the Sugar Plum, and I think I want to give one away. So I'll probably have that one in like a future giveaway, because I definitely don't need two. But anyways, so then we got some Lip Smackers, guys. You know me and my Lip Smackers. We got this Lip Smacker Tsum Tsum, and it's mini. She's all ready for Christmas, and her flavor is Cheerful Holiday Punch. So I'm excited to see what she's all about. Then, OMG. When I saw these, I almost passed out. 
So, <laughs> Lip Smacker has these new little tins and they look so vintage and fun and fabulous. So this one is strawberry flavored and I hardly even want to open it because it's like so perfect. And then this one is cotton candy flavored. So I am so pumped that I finally have those. All right, so I got a ton of Lip Smacker tubes. Yeah, yeah, look at this. Look at this girl. Oh my gosh, like, it's so crazy. So, all right, um, first I have this tube right here. It has a little nutcracker. He's so cute. Um, the flavors in this one are pumpkin brulee, cranberry, and peppermint mocha. Then we have this one right here, and this has a little Rudolph. Actually, no, it's not Rudolph. It's just a reindeer because he doesn't have the red nose. But let's see, this set comes with Holiday Punch, Eggnog, and Holiday Cookie. All right, and these ones I'm going to open up because I'm very, very curious about them. One of these was only three bucks, so that means each Lip Smacker was only a dollar, which is insane because usually Lip Smackers are a little bit more than that. So I want to open them up because I'm curious to see if they smell up to par because they were a lot cheaper. Um, so, okay, first we have this one, and the flavor is Sweet Mary Mint. Yeah, it still smells just like the good old Lip Smackers. Whoa, when I put that on, it smelled better. It smells like mint cheesecake. I give this one like a nine out of 10. Mm, and it tastes good too. Mm -mm -mm. Okay, then we have Holiday Punch. And oh my gosh. Okay, yeah, Um, I am not disappointed at all by these. This smells so good, it just made my mouth water. It's like the best fruit punch smell I've ever smelled in my life. I'm giving this a 10 out of 10. Next we have chocolate decadence, and let's smell it. Let's sniff it, guys, let's sniff it. Okay, this one does smell like chocolate. It's more mild, but it's pretty good. I'd give this one a seven out of 10. So next we have this purple candy cane, and again, I'm just gonna crack it right open, and we are going to see what these flavors are all about. So we have Holiday Vanilla. Um, I'm gonna swatch it a little bit. Ooh, okay, that literally smells like vanilla. I can't complain, it kinda smells like a vanilla ice cream cone. I'm gonna give it an eight out of 10. Then we have Santa's Cookie. So let's see, is this like a ginger snap cookie, a chocolate chip cookie, a snickerdoodle cookie? Let's find out, or a sugar cookie. Ooh, it smells like a mix of all three or four. <laughs> it smells really good. It kinda smells like a sugar cookie and maybe snickerdoodles and chocolate chips. It's really good. It's a very nice cookie-like scent. All right, then we have Mary Cherry. And this smells like straight up cherries. Yeah, that one's really good. It kind of smells like cherry cough drops a little bit. Or like, no, like cherry licorice, actually. I changed my mind. I would give this one a 7.5 out of 10. And then lastly, we have this candy cane and it's pink. So hopefully this one is the best because my favorite color is pink, as you guys know. Um, so this first one right here is pumpkin pie. You can never go wrong with a pumpkin pie lip balm, right? Oh, that smells like their pumpkin spice latte lip smacker Tsum Tsum. It's good, but I don't really think it smells too much like pumpkin pie though. So I'm going to give this a 6.5 out of 10. Then we have plumberry delight. Oh, okay. That smells like straight up plums, like straight up sugar plums. I'm going to rate this a nine out of 10. And then lastly, we have sweet strawberry. And let's guess, do we think the color is going to be pink or red for this one? I think it's gonna be red, reddish pink. Okay, I was, well, is that reddish pink to you? I say it's kind of reddish pink. It's like a dark pink actually, but okay. That is probably the best strawberry scent I've ever smelled from Lip Smacker. So I'm going to give this one a 10 out of 10. It's very, very good and it does not smell artificial at all. So guys, moving right along, I'm going to be showing you the very last thing that I bought from this giant $100 lip balm haul. Are you ready? I hope you are. Cause look at this, oh my gosh, this, this beauty right here was $10 and I simply could not pass it by. It has all of these amazing Lip Smacker flavors and look how cute the tin is. I don't know why I just did that. Like we're not doing ASMR right now. Um, but I'm gonna read you all of the flavors and I want you to comment below and tell me which one you would want the most. So we have, are you ready? <clears throat> 
fluffy caramel clouds, strawberry sunset, sprinkle drops, kiwi drift, sun-kissed honeydew, rainbow sherbet dreams, iridescent cherry, magical vanillusion, haha <laughs> vanillusion, so fancy and fun, apolorific prism, and blissful berry breeze, like oh. I think I'm probably most excited to try the sprinkle drops because what the heck is that going to smell like? I have no idea. So if you guys would like me to Okay, that was the tin that just fell upon my chair and it made a really loud thud. But as I was saying, if you guys would like me to do a video where I just test and review a bunch of holiday lip balms, definitely let me know because that is definitely something I could do for you guys. But anyways, that was all for today's ginormous $100 lip balm haul. I hope that you enjoyed watching this video. Definitely give it a thumbs up if you liked it. Also, don't forget to click that subscribe button to become an official member of the Star Fam and also click the notification bell so you are always notified whenever I upload a super fun, fabulous video like this one. I love you guys to the moon and back and I want you to comment below and let me know. Comment below how many lip balms are in your collection if you collect lip balms and if you don't, then just tell me how many you think you have, even if you have like two and they're both almost gone. I want to know how many lip balms you think you have in your household. So anyways, I love you guys so much. Thank you for watching and I will talk to you in my next video. Bye. Mwah.